my loves and welcome back to High Vibe Heels. My name is Ashlyn Tori. If you haven't been here before and if you have, welcome back. High Vibe Heels is a place where we combine dancing and heel with spirituality and inner work in order to create our most confident, badass selves. And today we are talking about living a really big, juicy life and not playing small. And this is such an important topic to me because I remember a time in my life where I did play small and I did live my life really small. And it was because of a lot of different things, but mostly it was because if I was worried about what people thought of me, I was worried about changing who I was because that would require me to push me out of my comfort zone and I had been living in my comfort zone for so long and I was also just scared of failing. I was scared of stumbling and messing up and all of these other things and excuses that we use when we are fearful of trying something new and we are fearful of living our life really full out and I see this a lot in my work and in my programs is that women especially really struggle with this because we've been told our entire life to stay small, to keep quiet, to just get by, to just keep the peace. And I am so for women throwing all of that out <laughs> and embodying this idea of living really big and bold and really using the full expression of ourself in order to create our dream life, in order to be the best dancer that we can be and in order to really experience the things in life that we came here to do. So that's exactly what this tapping is all about. It's really asking you to dive deep into what is it that you're holding out for? Why are you waiting so long to embrace this dream life, this big life? Why not just do it right now, okay? So go ahead, make sure you have water nearby. When we do a tapping, it is just like any other type of energetic release, whether it's a massage or acupuncture, you want to make sure that you replenish your nutrients and that you replenish your good energy, okay? And then all you're going to do is just repeat after me as we follow along on the different points on the body. So if you're ready, let's get into it. We're going to begin on the karate chop point, which is just on the side of the hands, and repeat after me. My whole life, I've been trying to blend in. Not rock the boat. Not piss off too many people. Be agreeable and soft and sweet and kind. That has gotten me absolutely nowhere. Sure, my life is okay, but it could be great. I know that I'm settling for less than I deserve. Because I'm scared. I'm scared of what will happen if I play full out. I see and hear what people call women who are loud and proud. And it is not nice. But worrying about what others think of me and playing small just to make them feel comfortable is a waste of this one beautiful and precious life. I'm wasting my potential just to keep the peace. That is outrageous. And I'm sick of it. I'm sick of this little bubble of fear that I've held myself in for so long. It's time to pop this damn bubble. All right, my loves, deep breath in. Hold it at the top, exhale, let it go. Good. Go ahead and grab a big drink of water. That was a lot, and we are going to start on the top of the head. Even though I haven't been living big or playing full out, I love and accept myself anyway. I know that it's just a product of my conditioning And the best part about that is, I have the ability to change it. 
There have been so many things I wanted to do in the past. But I didn't. I just played it safe. I went with the easier decision. And honestly, I regret that so much. I don't want to live a life full of what ifs and regrets. That's boring and it's lame. I want to live so big that when I look back on my life, I'm absolutely astonished at all that I did and all that I accomplished. I want to blow my own mind with the life that I live. All of my wildest dreams and manifestations. And more coming true. And in order for that to happen, I've got to grow a pair of tits and stop letting my smallness take over. The fear, the comparison, the self-doubt, It all needs to take a back seat. No one plays a big game without failure. Without hiccups and strikeouts. It's going to happen. And now that I've acknowledged that, Stop allowing it to keep me from my dreams. I have something really big that I want to do. I can feel it in my bones that it's part of my soul's journey here on the planet. But instead of listening to my intuition, I ask for everyone else's opinions. I ask the tarot. I ask my birth chart. I ask my therapist. But here's the secret. The only person who knows what's best for me is me. I know the easy choice is to not go for it. I know that. And push it off until a later date that I continue to keep pushing off. Or wait for a new year and a new moon to start it. But why not start right now? I acknowledge that I'm afraid. I acknowledge that I don't know the how or when of it all. But that's okay. What if I saw the unknown as the fun parts? as a beautiful block of clay that would slowly start to form into something really beautiful and really magical. My life is the clay. I 
I just have to start molding it, baby. Taking things away that don't fit and that don't serve me. And trusting that it's going to be a beautiful masterpiece in the end. I have to trust myself and the universe to get the job done. And when I feel the desire to shrink back into my shell and play small, I will just remember Ashlyn Torrey saying, don't you even dare. <laughs> I am too powerful and too radiant for mediocre shit. We don't do mediocre shit. It's time to get off the couch, turn my phone on airplane mode, Put on the outfit that makes me feel like a badass bitch and get to W-E-R-K work. I will never reach new heights if I'm too scared to take the first step of the ladder. All of the intelligence, wisdom, passion, ability that I need is already inside of me. I just have to allow the floodgates to open. To live big. And to play full out every damn day. And so it is. Amazing job, my loves. Take a deep breath in. Holding at the top, exhale, let it go. Amazing, amazing job, Angels. I hope this tapping impacted you the way that it impacted me. I have a fire under my booty. I am ready to work. I'm ready to dance. I'm ready to take action. I'm ready to live big, baby. <laughs> and that's what this tapping is all about. And you can really come back to it anytime you need that little boost or a reminder of why it is that you are taking the leaps and that you are moving past your fears. And if you want to do that in a really exponential way, my program Confidence, the Heals Method is open for enrollment in just a few more days and we are going to begin the program after Thanksgiving. So if you are ready to take your confidence to the next level, to take your dancing and heal your burlesque to the next level, and also to stop playing small, then click the link below, book a free discovery call with me. This 90 day program will completely shift your life. And I have so many student testimonials here on YouTube of women that it has done exactly that for. I really do believe of the power of dancing in a heel combined with this deep spirituality, inner work, self-love, and it's really powerful what that combination of things can do for you. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a like below, subscribe to the channel, check out Confidence, and I will see you babes in the next video.